Um. <laughs> Alice Elf, yes. Hey everyone, today we're reviewing My Toy Pony. Yay. Okay, let's start off by reviewing the packaging. Here we have the logo, My Toy Pony. Like, why is it so small in the corner? Then there's a drawing of a fake G3 who looks terrified. We have the two ponies, we have this bright green one and this blue one and they both have Pinkie Pie's cutie mark. Yeah, I'll get into that later. But they also come with um, a mirror, a brush, a comb and a hairdryer because ponies have hands, right? Right? Let's take a quick look at the back of the box. It says, My Toy Pony again. Then some descriptions in every single language possible. Specifications, colours and contents may vary. Wow. Good job, My Toy Pony. You can't even keep all sets the same. Please retain the information on this pack for future reference. Um, nah. Warning, choking has a blah 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 blah. And they actually have a website, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna check this out. For an actual brand? What? What? Our brands, this can't be true. We have Toy Story, Peppa Pig, Hello Kitty, Barbie, Monster High, no, this can't be true. Vision, to be first choice for innovative quality toys worldwide. Quality toys! Products and services that exceed expectations. Whoa! So I guess without further ado, let's open them up. So you can see on packaging, but her hair is actually stuck in with the plastic, like this hair here. Ew! Okay. Way. So here's everything included in the package. I'll take a look at the accessories first. Okay, first off, we have this really, really ratchet comb with this number printed on the back. Like, why? And also, all of these have, like, handheld, like, grip for dolls. But these, these are ponies. They don't have hands. Here we have a comb. On one side it has hearts. Lovely. This little mirror with some flowers on the back. How beautiful. And then we have this gun. No, it's a hairdryer, but it looks like a gun. Can they not? <laughs> what are they expecting? She's not going to be able to hold that. Or that. But anyway, jump aside, let's look at the ponies. First we have this lime green pony with Pinkie Pie's cutie mark, which is slightly scratched off. And they're made of this really shiny, cheap plastic. Um, yeah. <laughs> Her head turns, oh what is that, ew, ew, okay, um, her head turns but her neck is uh, clearly broken, like what, what the heck. On the other side she's plain but they have these weird like inside bits to their feet, like what even is that? <laughs> her hair is pretty short actually and on the top she is half bald so I guess they forgot to root her fringe. Good job! Take out these rubber bands now so we can see them in their full glory. Aside from the balding, she also has this kind of melted plasticky part because quality! Also no white in the eyes and she is like falling apart literally so let's fix that. <laughs> yeah, here we have um, Lime Pie I guess since she has Pinkie Pie's cutie mark, I call her Lime Pie. Um, yeah, let's look at Blueberry Pie! She's really falling apart and she also has the kind of balding issue. Um, yeah, this, this is great. I, I, I love her. She is, ah, my OC! To be honest though, the hair quality of these ponies is actually really good compared to some of the newer My Little Ponies. They're, they're really, like, plasticky, but these ones are quite soft. Like, aside from the actual base plastic being, like, actual trash, uh, the hair quality isn't that bad. <laughs> Look! Ah! <laughs> what? Um... Uh. <laughs> Oops. Fix. Okay, okay, okay. Ah, yes, yes. Oh, no! Wait, huh? Oh, no! Okay, okay. Blueberry pie has been saved. Here's blueberry pie next to an actual My Little Pony. Um, yeah, you can really tell the plastic difference. This one's all shiny and has a massive hole in her face. And this one is like soft plastic. The hair quality is really nice and pretty and great. And these are both just earth ponies, so they're really basic. Um, but yeah. But on the bright side, I think I might hot glue their heads and like bodies together so they're like not gonna fall apart. And then I could use them as a base for customs maybe. Or like turn them into some kind of like evil zombie pony or something like that. 
because I don't think I'm gonna get an actual good custom out of this like ew like her whole head can come apart so that's it for this review let me know in the comments below if you guys want me to review any more fake ponies or dolls or Lilith's pet shop that'll be really fun and I'll see you guys in my next video bye guys thank you for watching my new video if you want to watch my previous video click to the left or if you want to watch a random video of mine click to the right see you soon